Welcome back. As you watch how I get the nuke with the SU-100P, I'll talk about the new stuff that is coming in next update. First of all, recently as I was making a review about the object, developers decided to nerf all of the 100mm rounds of the Soviets. SU-100P and object uses that round. So basically an overpressure nerf, uh, now you'll deal less damage. I don't know how you even determine that round is OP or not. I mean, it's a round. Let it one tap, as long as it's not creating the nuke effect. So as I was playing with these tanks, you're gonna see in this video as well, I couldn't one tap light targets such as Scorpion, a Hellcat, and some side shots. The round was just disappearing between track and hull. In next update, we're gonna have some new mechanics and new vehicles. Skink belongs to the Briton, rank 4. It has quad 20mm turrets. The skink is based on the Grizzly 1 medium tank, which in turn represent the Canadian licensed produced version of the American M4A1 Sherman tank. I will see its efficiency in the ground realistic match. So far, don't get hyped up, because Warblewind is at rank 3, skink will be at the rank 4, that means minimum BR is uh, could be 5.0. That's basically where Ostwind 2 is right now. Also, not sure about the third rotation. Could be slow. Next one is PBV 302 Bill. Light tank, Sweden, rank 6. 20mm autocannon with ATGM. VK 30. Prototype Panther. <laughs> I'll call it Plastic Panther. 75mm of cannon and good mobility. Second Mephisto type of vehicle, HJ9, the Red Arrow. Tank Destroyer, China, rank 6. Like, obviously, parameters here similar to the Mephisto. Even have retractable launcher, thermal vision, good mobility, powerful missiles, classic stuff. So, not that unique. But it's good to see that China receiving uh, more and more vehicles, a really underrated nation right now in the game. But it's slowly becoming powerful as Soviets. We have a premium pack pre-order VRSS Centauro. Light tank Italy, rank 6, premium. It has thermal vision, so this is basically a Spanish version of the Centauro. So if any pendejos there, good for you. First Spanish tank. <laughs> They're even given Conquistador sticker. And also new mechanic, aircraft, engine, fire extinguishers. They're gonna serve same as in the tanks. There's two types, automatic, fire extinguisher and manual. Depending what plane or helicopter you have, you're gonna be able to extinguish your aircraft. But yeah, before, when you burn a plane, you would've just get off tail and fly a different direction, now you have to make sure that he's dead for good, otherwise someone will steal your kill. Alright guys, so that was it, and now I'm getting the nuke, it was quite a passive gameplay actually, but nuke is the nuke, enjoy. No. Another <laughs> shot for the scorpion. It's still alive. How ridiculous is that, guys? This scorpion took three shots to kill. And I see that Tiger 2 is moving towards me. Trying to get his lower plate, uh, missing the shot. He is behind the tree now. And try to get his turret cheek. 
after this. A beautiful ammunition explosion. Searching for new targets. I see that tiger too is standing there. Another tank is passing. Bam, it's a Yak Panther getting a strike. Bomber kills like three of them, <laughs> including the Yak Panther. Uh, we're slowly bleeding tickets. It's time to move. I'm gonna try to decap. Uh, one of our teammates decapping the objective. I'm noticing someone there, that's a new tank. And also Scorpion at the right, I'm gonna switch to it later on. I think it got spooked a bit when he heard the shot. Yeah, yellow crew. Hit in the middle of the Scorpion and getting yellow crew this is the war thunder now guys explosive rounds are freaking useless uh, getting the t26 but dying to the tiger uh, noticing that i have nuke so let's just save this match there's three enemy aircrafts up Four airplanes, but it's too late. I'm dropping the nuke. That's an interesting comeback. With the nine kills, passive gameplay, saving the match. You can support the channel through links in the description. I'll see you in the next one, and peace out.